Hi, yeah, so what's your name then? Um, my name's Twilight. How long have you been in the festival theatre? Um, about two years now. This year is Alice in Wonderland, and what's your role? Um, I play the White Queen in the second act, and I play a harped card in the first act. How often do you um, rehearse? Um, well, we um, it depends really on your character role, but in the late stages of rehearsals, um, four times a week. Um, but it's all worth it, worth it in the end. You made lots of new friends here. Hundreds of new friends, it's, and not only new friends, it's almost like when we get to the show and when we get into the theatre, it's like one big family, and I know that's a bit cliche to say, but it really is, and by the end of it, you've just got hundreds of people that are your extended family. So how easy is it, is it for you to join the youth theatre? Um, it's really easy to put your name forward. Um, all you have to do is give in your name and your address and your contact number and then they draw you out the hat. So it's the luck of the draw really. Um, but once you then get into the theatre, so that's when you have to audition for um, <laughs> things like um, the shows. Excellent. Would you recommend any young people to come and watch Alice in Wonderland? Oh my god, yes. Because it's not a typical pantomime. It's not a pantomime, it's a, um, a show and it's not what people would expect because in some ways it's quite dark um, and quite mystical in a way, yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Describe it. Yeah, that's cool, thanks very much. Okay. <laughs> Hi, so what's your name? Hi, my name's Tom Bullpit. I'm 16 years old and I've been at the Chichester Festival Youth Theatre for about six years now. So you've been involved in lots of different um, appearances? Uh, yeah, my first one was Grimm's Tales uh, a long time ago, and uh, I've been doing it almost every year since uh, about 2005, 2006, yeah. Where did you get into youth theatre? Well, I first started off at Stagecoach uh, Company, which was for singing, dancing and acting, and I, I really got into the acting side of it, so I wanted to find a company where I could just act, and well, I found a the theatre. I was really lucky to get in the first time, and I'm, I've been enjoying it ever since. So once you've joined, do you just stay in it, or do you have to join again each year? Well, uh, you have to put your name forward each year for staying in. There is a, a huge waiting list at the moment. I think it's about 600 people. It's a, it's a really popular company. Uh, I, I said I'm really lucky just to stay in this company and I said I'm enjoying it so I plan to keep staying in it every year. Rehearsals, how much do you enjoy those? Oh, they're great fun. Uh, we're all, it's, it's a really tight-knit company. We all have fun together. We can all relax. It's, it's always a really good experience. How easy do you think it is to actually join the youth theatre then? It's uh, it's quite it's quite easy. As I said there is quite a long waiting list, but as long as you are committed and you just sign yourself up and you, as I said, you be patient and wait, you will get in. And as soon as you get in, you'll have so much fun. I mean, the performances are fantastic, and uh, the, the weekly workshop workshops as well are also really good fun as well. So do you get to learn about um, how to act and things like that as well? Yeah, they teach you uh, a lot of uh, sort of the details and to refine your sort of performing skills. We do. Uh, a lot of work with marks, masks in the in the weekly performance workshops and uh, stage fighting and just uh, character work. It's uh, it really helps you build on what you already know about acting. Excellent. Would you recommend um, young people to come and watch Alice in Wonderland? Yeah, I, I really would. It's a uh, it's a really fun show. If they want to come and see a show where they could just see the enjoyment of just this this girl Alice who's on this adventure, then please come. It's a it's a fantastic show, and I think you'll really enjoy it. Excellent. Thank you. Your name? Tim Horn. So what's your role within the Chichester Youth Theatre? I'm the Associate Director, which is sort of a, somewhere between an Assistant Director and a Director on this winter's, this Christmas show, which is Alice in Wonderland. So the actual Director's name is? Dale Brooks, who's the head of our Youth Theatre here and always directs the Christmas show. The best thing about the Youth Theatre in Chichester is that the Youth Theatre in Chichester takes youth, theory, youth seriously. A lot of Youth Theatres try and make kids, teenagers, performance adults or do things outside of their range or ignore the fact that they're young whereas the youth theatre in Chichester makes the youth the centre of the performance and it makes the most out of young people so and Alice in Wonderland is a perfect example of that because you're talking about a story that can only be told from the point of view of a child, of a young person. Alice is seven and a half uh, and the brilliance of the book and the reason it's lasted so long is because Alice in Wonderland is a way that we can access childhood, we can access 
the impressions and the point of view of a young person in a way that no other literature has seemed to have been able to capture. So this is a perfect play for the youth theatre, especially this particular youth theatre, because it's a chance to show the world a different point of view, a younger point of view, and to deliver that with young people is fantastic, and of course the, you know, the only way it can really be done. So would you recommend any young person within the area to come and try and join? Absolutely, I think this is one of the best resourced, most far-reaching professional youth theatres that you can possibly join. I think it competes on a national level as well as a regional one as being a really incredible programme. Dale Brooks who runs it and everybody at the youth department who I've got to know are incredibly committed and talented people. The youth I have worked with have all been of varying degrees of uh, talent or commitment or age but all of them have the same thing in common which is they, they bring a lot to the theatre and they get a lot out of it no matter what their previous experience may be, no matter what they think they're going to get when they arrive, they all go away leaving with the same amount of expertise and having com contributed something really fantastic to the theatre. Excellent, thank you.